Bad language warning. Let's write a movie. The podcast. Hello, welcome to the podcast. My name's Paul. My name's Jeffrey. <laughs> Hello, Jeffrey. Um, <laughs> Not really. It's Rowan. Oh gosh, I it's, thought it was Jeff. Yeah, it's Rowan. Uh, anyway, this is Let's Write a Movie. But no, it is a podcast good. where we take. It's been a long time. Bear with me. We take a, a, a yeah. setup. You're struggling, eh? Cool, I am. It's been a while. Your hair's a mess. Well, that's just a standard, anyway. It's bo. <laughs> bo can't be helped. What's you know? to you? <laughs> we take a setup. Tragic. A conflict. It's gone down now. We didn't mention. And a resolution. He's changed. Uh, we take random ideas for these things, and we put them together. In a generator. And we put him in a movie. No, no, sorry. And we do a fantastic job at it, like you've witnessed in the 30-odd episodes that we have previously done. And we're professional, and we do the job right. Isn't that right, Ryan? Well, we try to, and if we don't get bit of a satisfaction, mm. there is a ro- warranty. It used to there be is. a guarantee, now it's a warranty. <laughs> so you can actually come around our houses, and we'll do a live performance. <laughs> That's different. You stay away from our houses. The will. Because oh, you stink. Oh, yeah. Sorry. It's got that you shield, do. isn't it? He's a smell. BO like. shield. BO, man. I smell you from here. It's yeah. a hot country. Yeah, but no one sweat. No one should sweat as much as you do. Anyway, <laughs> do you want to, as you have done in, in the past, do you want to pick the random ideas? We'll start with the setup. I don't, but I will. Okay. Go rummage in around. Here we go. Father didn't get the bonus he was promised. Oh, that's a nightmare. Oh. And a very typical Christmas movie situation. That's, yes. Oh, we haven't done a um, a <clears throat> location or genre. Well, it's going to be Christmassy, isn't it? Yeah, like Christmas, Christmas movie genre. And we'll work out the location. Yeah. That's fine. And then conflict... Here we go. Their arms fall off. <laughs> As if, I mean, this family's already been for enough. Not getting that bonus, and now that. <laughs> okay, resolution. Where's the resolutions? There's one. Okay. Their flies had been down the whole time. Their penis hanging out. <laughs> I mean, this is Christmas all over, isn't it? <laughs> oh, Christ. Okay. <laughs> so the, we've got a father, and he didn't get the bonus on time. So it's going to affect his family, that, isn't it? His children, his wife. <laughs> his penis. His penis. Um. Okay. Right. <laughs> so how are we going to start this? So where does the um, where does so we set it in America? Most Christmas movies are set in America. Yeah, we you can do an American do. accent. We've done it before. I'm American. I'm from the South. I'm from New York. I'm a New Yorker. Boston. <laughs> yeah, I'll we'll just do a generic. Generic. Yeah, American. I'm American. My mother. So um, so like so the movie set in Middle America. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. It's in Milwaukee. It's in Milwaukee. 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 Kansas City, Milwaukee. I don't think that's a thing. <laughs> Fine, it's, it's, it's just no. It's, come on, please. It's set in Kansas, it's Kansas City. Kansas Milwaukee. City, Milwaukee. And what state's that? That's in Florida. Okay. <laughs> so we're in America. Yep. Father, what's he called? Joe. Yeah, oh, definitely Joe. It's Joe. Joe. He yeah. lives with his two kids. Yep. It's not um. Name. Chad. In, Jürgen. Chad and Charity. Chad and Charity. Yeah. Chad and Charity. Yeah. They live in a nice house. Got a nice life. Oh, Car. Yeah, nice. And his wife's there. His wife is called Mary Sue. Mary Sue. Yeah. <laughs> She's got a long hair. Yeah. Oh, very long hair. It's always attracted him. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> very straight as well, and it has a gleam to it in certain lights. Mm. Yes. Especially in dawn, on the in the dawn light. 
mm. dusk light, he meant she looks really old. So he doesn't look at her in the dusk. He doesn't at, look at her in the dusk. At dusk. But that in the sense. dawn, he likes to catch her. But, you know, even past past dusk, it's fine. But it's just it's, that, that one hour period. Yeah. yeah. After dusk, like a, a lamp mm. on her reveals the beauty of her hair. That makes but sense. About the dusk she usually does like the washing up during that time. Yeah, that's right. She's doing the washing up and he'll just bring the lamp out, plug it yeah. in and just face it at her. And then he just and then he just stands and watches as she washes up and he admires her hair. Makes sense. She doesn't like it though. But she just loves him, so she puts up with it. Getting pretty far into Well this is the mindset of This um, is the mindset of him, isn't it? What's he called? Joe. Joe, yeah. He's quite obsessive. He's actually yeah. And his but his wife is very accommodate accommodating of his obsessions. Yeah. His little quirks. He's eccentric, Joe. He's eccentric. He's eccentric. And I love... That's one of the things that I love about him. He's a bit different. <laughs> Mary Sue just popping in there. Yeah. Um. So Joe obviously needs a job to have a bonus. Yeah, so he comes... But he doesn't get it. So it's... So he, is he like corporate? He's corporate, man. Works for a Briefcase. Tire... Briefcase. Works no, in the corporate no. office of a tire company? No, no. No? No. He works for a company yeah. that removes basements from people's houses. Okay, just, just concretes them right up. Yeah. <laughs> That's strong foundation. It's like, it's like yeah. Cellar okay. removal firm. They're called Cellar Removals, Florida. Okay. So, C- City, CRF. Milwaukee, Florida. <laughs> CRF. Yeah. So, he has a cap of CRF on, and the logo is a house yeah. like, a, the, like a diagram a side diagram of yeah. a house and it's like um, over the basement is just big um, company branded font saying no more yeah makes sense <laughs> so that's he's good, uh, that's a good des- um, what's it called design guide as well yeah you have to keep to so he's a salesman actually mm. he goes door to door trying to sell this this yeah makes sense <laughs> To people, yeah. So the opening scene opens on him. He does door to door sales. Okay. Well, hi there, partner. Hey there. Well, I'm from CRF. Have you heard of us? No. What do y'all do? Well, it stands for Shed on Removal, Florida. Because, and what we Makes like sense. We're in Florida. Yeah. Continue, partner. I see you got a cellar. I have got a cellar. Boy, how do you smart? Do you use it? Can I ask you? Or is it I a- don't use it for shit. Is it a hindrance? Absolutely. Well, then. It's cold and it's dusty. And it's muggy because this is Florida. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I'm going to say something to you. And I want you to react naturally. Go for it, partner. Cellar, be gone. Boy, howdy, that's a great idea. We can remove your cellar. For a, a, a really good fee, $25,000, and it's gone. Damn. And no more hindrance. God damn, that's unbelievable pricing. Chris, can I just ask you, sir, how old are you? I'm 45 years young. So your knees will be feeling it, walking down those <laughs> steps, up and down the steps. Do you enjoy that? I hate it. But the thing is, I bet you don't even go down those steps because you never use it. I don't use it at all. Motherfucker. <laughs> oh, so. <coughs> Fucking hell. So I had to, sorry, I just want to apologize for my language there. But I get excited when I talk about my, what we can offer. Well, I can imagine so. Now, so... Are you willing to go? Would you like to? Would you like any more information, or uh, would you like me to? No, just sign me up, partner. Oh my God, you are a man of my own means. I've been needing this done for years and years. You sh- I feel like God has brought you to me. Well, that's interesting you say that, because God is why I'm doing this job. Oh, it makes sense, partner. <laughs> I was in my mother-in-law's basement. Rolling round on the floor. It wasn't a good... <laughs> Sorry. It wasn't a good time of my life. 
whilst I was doing this, I thought, hey, what if these kind of rooms didn't exist? And I could offer a service to someone. So I Googled it. And there was a company. And here I am, sir. Well, you've done a mighty fine job. So Sign me up. Where's the documentation? There you go. Oh, sir. I'll put my Sign old John Hancock on that. Yeah, mother. <laughs> nice hand. I it. can't wait. You got I it. hope you get a nice bonus for this. <laughs> yeah. So, well, so, actually, so I've hit 10 for the week. Oh, fantastic. That's bonus territory right there. So, okay, what I can see, tell you now is you'll get a, a follow-up call from Patricia and she'll be she'll come here in person in her wheelchair <laughs> tomorrow and she'll take a look at you. <laughs> Sorry. She'll take, it, she'll take a look at you, Shella. And then it could be five minutes later and the truck will come in. And what we do is we, we throw Polish Star in Word, right. uh, uh, unused uh, dog kennels, and then what we do—that's the base. And then we come in and we pump cement in, Makes and sense. then and then we fill it up. Oh. And then you don't have a cinema anymore. That's fantastic! I can't wait. I hope it's done in time for Christmas. Okay, we'll be following up. So, um, I'm, I love you. Oh, 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 I'm quite a God loves too. You. God loves you. Oh, God loves you too. And right, me. bye. Bye. So he's back at the office. <clears throat> he uh, he goes to tell his boss about this amazing quick sell that he's done. You know, some some say that you know he probably could have done it done it quicker, but that was fine. <laughs> so um, he's at his bo- his boss's office. Come in. Hey, boss. It's just me, Frank. Oh, hello, Joe. Joe. <laughs> and, um, I've just done another sale, so that's 10 for the week. Oh, you've done a fantastic job. Thank you. And it, if it wasn't for you, I don't think I could achieve the achievements I've achieved. Oh, well, you know, you've done really well. Um, there's a slight issue. Because um, I'll get me, get me bonus now, I? Well, the uh, problem with the bonus is, uh, <clears throat> well, let me say, we've had a bit of trouble this, this year. You've been building this company long. What? But Unfortunately, you're the only one that's been pulling this company along. So, uh... What are you saying? Some, what, some... what, are you, what are you saying here, boss? Well, basically, you're, you're not going to be getting your bonus this year. Mother... I do apologize. I can't... I, I was relying on that. I hope your family take it okay, but, you know, <sighs> I do apologize. Mom, God, but we had a special Christmas trip. We had a, a Christmas activity. Oh. You know that big elm tree down in Russell? Oh, yeah, that's a lovely Canyon? elm tree, yeah. We were going to climb it as a family and put a big star on the top because it's Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> no, we can't do that. Well, I know the bonus would have bought that star for you, but, uh, you know, I'm sure you'll still have a lovely time. Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um... Okay, well, I've got to go and tell the family, oh man. Well, this is for the rain on my parade. Oh, I do apologize. Could you close the door, please? I'll go, and I'm going to retreat backwards and not take my eyes off you, mother... Okay. I'm f- and so he, he closes the door. Yep. <coughs> Knocks it once. <laughs> Knocks it once. <laughs> yep. And then he sat at his desk, you, mm-hmm. and you see um, Joe come into view. What's the, in the, uh, window, what's the uh, window behind him? Yeah, the boss is called Mrs. Heseltine. Yeah, so, so you, you see, she's looking the other way, but he's in the window and he's like looking yeah. at the back of his head. Yep. Scratching his head. Like, just looking at her. Yeah. And then he looks down, looks up, looks to the left, looks to the right, and then it really quick he's out of, out of view. Yeah. And it cuts to him and he's sprinting. Wow. He's sprinting. So he gets home and he's like... <laughs> and um, so he sits down. Okay. And he has to tell his wife. Yeah. Oh, God. So he comes in really sweaty. <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, it's me. Oh, did you have a nice time at work? Well, 
What's she called? Um, Mary Jane. Ma- oh, Mary Sue. Mary Sue. Um, can you sit down? Oh, yeah. I'll just, oh, I'll yeah. Just, one just, second. Yeah. And he goes off and he goes and grabs a lamp mm. and he puts the lamp on the table yeah. and turns it on. And he's like fiddling around and he gets it just right. And you see him smile. <laughs> but then he sits down. I've got some bad news for you. Well, what is it? Well, you know that... That bonus? Yeah? Well, it seems the company isn't performing as well as the thought they were going to. But you've been doing so well. Oh, yeah. You know where this is, where this is going, don't you? No. Well, I'm not getting the bonus. What? So no claim? I know. I know. I can't believe it. So no tree climbing for us. Oh. I know. Could we still just climb a tree and not put a star on top? Well, I mean, we, 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 we really, we've got that really nice tree in the garden. Oh, yeah. Call the kids. Chad. Charity. So they come running out. Yeah. Oh, David. Quality. Mommy. Still, kids, um, I'm afraid we won't be climbing that huge elm tree we were looking at. What? I don't down. believe it, Pa. Yeah. I'm, some things haven't worked out at work. No. Yeah, my, my, my boss isn't the man he said he was, basically. And I don't... Anyway, let's not get into that. You don't need to know this, but I don't trust okay. them. I, I don't trust them. Do we still get to, to yeah. put the star on the elm tree, Pa? Well, the tree in our garden is going to have to be that tree. So we're going to go and do that now. Oh, get your stuff on. Okay. Get your harnesses okay, on. Okay, dear. Okay, Pa. Come on, everyone. Let's go. So they start climbing the tree. <clears throat> mm. Now, Chad's... Like, Joe's leading it. Yeah. Um, but as Chad is on, like, the bottom branch, yeah, his arms come out and fall off. And his arms... <laughs> he just are, fall off? Well, so he's basically... He got, his torso... No, they just come out. He's a bit... It's a, they're all a bit like Barbie dolls. It's weird. Oh, okay. So he's... He falls off the tree, but his arms are still holding on to the branch. Oh, shit. And he's on the floor. And it's just his legs. Yeah. And then the same happens to, what's she called, the daughter? Uh, Charity. Charity. Mm. She's like two more branches up. And then the same happens to Mary Jane. Oh, shit. And then he's just about to get to the top, mm. and he hears all this commotion underneath, and he looks down, and he's like, oh, my God, what's happening here? We have lost our arms, dear. Oh, uh, And then he do, does pa? it. And then his arm, it happens to him. He falls with his arms left. Shit. So they're on the floor. Kick yeah. it, like kicking them out <laughs> trying to get up mm. and they do stand up and they look up and they see their arms just hanging yeah it almost looks like Christmas decorations yeah exactly on the tree yeah it's it's natural decorations so they so, freak out yeah and they're like um, my god we've got no arms they're on the tree what do we do now and they're like well we could decorate the arms with our feet. So they're, they're happy with the decorations. The, the yeah. arm decorations. They're like, okay, that works. They thought, you know, we can't let this ruin our Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> so, this is um, part of the Christmas You know, experience. it's not obviously, obviously not Christmas yet. Um, it's, it's the 23rd, mm. which it is today as well. Um, but anyway, <laughs> that's off topic. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> um, so it's Christmassy. It's the next day. You know, they've, they've all had a pretty restless night. You know, none of them have got arms anymore. Um, and he goes to go and do the job at the... Um, oh, yeah. At the... Uh, at that, that guy's house, place. The yeah. guy's house, yeah. So he gets to the door and, um, you know, because he wants to greet the person. So... Hey, I'm just following up. Hey, I'm just making sure everything's in place and you're happy with the contract. Or... Oh, boy, howdy. Are you starting today? Well, yeah, the guys have been coming in today, so I just wanted to oh, double fair. check. Wait, but wait, everything's in place. wait, wait a minute. What's that doing hanging out of your pants? Has that always been like that, partner? I don't. You tell me. Was it out last time? Well, I don't recall, sir. I do not look down. Usually. Hey, 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 hey! Have you always had that out? Hey, yours is. Yup, I can see your. Oh pants. my God, mine is out your too. Pants is out too. I don't believe this. <laughs> 
Oh my god! Well, I'm so sorry, sir. Well, what, so, what are we going to do about this situation? I, I, well, I don't know. Partner. We, well, it's Christmas, so. Do you wanna? Do you wanna go down to the cellar before you fill it up? What I mean, I do like pigs and blankets at Christmas. <laughs> Oh, me too, partner. So they go down to the basement. And have, like, ravaging sex. <laughs> you can't assume so. The, the no, 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 no. Because they're not, they're not men of the world. Uh, so they just stand true. cross and just slap penises together. <laughs> what, like, what's going on here? I, and I don't know. What's this situation? Oh, I don't know, but I like it. <laughs> slap, slap. Slap, slap, slap. A few more slaps, but you don't actually see it because it's a family movie, so you just hear the slap, 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 slap. Yeah, but then some polystyrene and do- some dog kennels are thrown in, mm. and then the concrete comes in. It's a yeah. horrible ending, actually. And they're trapped and they get killed. Yeah. Like with the concrete, they get because the cellar gets filled up with concrete. Yeah. And they're in it. Oh god! And their penises are out forever. And the penises are preserved. Out. Yeah. Oh gosh. Wow. And it just cuts to a scene at the house of his family. And mm. all just, they're just like walking around the house with no arms. Just trying to do things. Just wondering where the Just like trying to is. turn the TV on with the head. And, yeah. Like she's trying to cook, get the Christmas meal ready, but she's got like the pan in her mouth. <laughs> and like she's getting the veg out with yeah. her mouth. And then Timmy's... Is it sort of like a, a montage sort It's of a montage, scene. yeah. And like you know, Chad's... Dad's not there. Chad's in his bedroom and he's like... like with his nose trying mm. to use the the joy pad. But at the same time, they're all crying. Mm. And then it ends. The whole movie... Yeah, <laughs> it just ends there. The whole movie is basically um, a metaphor for Broken Homes. Yeah. What a Christmassy film. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, so what you, um, what you want to call this masterpiece? Arms at Christmas. Arms of Christmas. Um, All I want for Christmas is me two front arms. <laughs> me two front arms. <laughs> um, um, something quite like simple. Um, something to do with the bounce. Arms off, knobs out. <laughs> arms off, knobs out. It's Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, guys. It's Christmas. <laughs> uh, something more generic. Um, unusual Christmas. Unusual Christmas. It's a tricky one, isn't it? Broken Christmas. Christmas dicks. <laughs> Christmas dicks. What is Christmas without arms? It's too long. <laughs> armless Christmas. Armless Christmas. Arm armless Christmas fun. Like harmless Christmas fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's armless Christmas fun. Yeah, why not? Yeah, armless Christmas fun. <laughs> That's awful. That'll do. All right, actors. We've got quite a few actors here. Yeah, we have, haven't we? Um, who have we got? So we've got the main guy, Joe. Joe. I'm thinking it has to be all classic American actors, isn't it? Like, or at least, you know, well-known current actors. Yeah. Um, Seth Rogen. Could he do that, though? Could you do a kind of... Could you be a fa- like a family man? Seth Rogen yeah, could be... You could have Seth Rogen as the guy who's getting his cellar yeah, cemented. Yeah. Um, and then Joel could be played by... Paul Rudd. Uh, Paul Rudd's a family man. He could be a family man. I don't know if he'd fit. I had him in mind as a society deranged. Tim Allen? Mm. Get him in for another Christmas, Christmas movie. movie. <laughs> you want someone who's going to get bums on the seats. Um, Bill Murray. Bill Murray. Maybe. He could get another. Yeah. Yeah, Bill Murray is the, is the, the hickey. The wife, Oprah Winfrey. Oprah Winfrey is the wife. Yeah. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> uh, Charity and, and Chad. I don't know. I don't know any kid actors. Harry Styles. He's a bit old, isn't he? Yeah, he still looks young, though. <laughs> Harry Styles for and Chad. And Miley Cyrus. And Miley Cyrus for Charity. <laughs> <laughs> well, she has had a try acting, hasn't she? And then the boss could be... Oh, we're the boss. Danny, um, uh, Danny Glover. See, I think Oprah Winfrey would be good as the boss. Okay. So the, so the wife could be played What about Mariah by Carey? Mariah Carey. 
Yeah. <laughs> Sorted. <laughs> That's Christmassy, isn't it? That is Christmassy. She's all about Christmas. We've got all the characters there. Is that all of them? Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. We okay, well. Smash through that. That was a good one, wasn't it? <clears throat> and it's called Armless Christmas Arm- Fun. Armless Christmas Fun. Yeah. Sorted. Yeah. Wow. So thanks uh, to people who have listened to the whole catalogue of Let's Write Baby, yeah. or at least a majority of it. It's nice that you've listened, that you've taken the time. Yes. And maybe one day we'll return. Who knows? Hope you enjoyed it. Mm. And I hope your Christmas is filled with Christmas cheer. Yeah, and I hope you don't lose your arms. Because that would be a nightmare. And don't. But hey, it's just armless Christmas fun.